What I got, you can't buy. It resides between my eyes. Walk through the fire, came out better on the other side. See lights like a beach if you find the same. And right now, I'm feeling like a hundred grand. You are listening to Inspired Insider with your host, Dr. Jeremy Wise. Dr. Jeremy Weiss here, founder of InspiredInsider.com, where I talk with inspirational entrepreneurs like the founders of P90X, The Paleo Diet with Dr. Lauren Cordain, The Orlando Magic, and many more, and how they overcome big challenges in life and business. This episode is brought to you by Rise25, which I co-founded with my business partner, John Corcoran. Rise25's mission is to connect business owners to their ideal peers, prospects, and strategic partners. We do it in three ways. One, we do these live in-person VIP days and receptions with top entrepreneurs all over the country. We also have a complete done-for-you service for podcasting and content marketing. So people just show up, they talk, and we do everything else. And also, we do it online connections through done-for-you lead generation where we manage a consistent and systemized outreach to your ideal clients. Since it requires a lot of humans, we don't work with everyone. We have limited bandwidth. But if you are interested, you can go to rise25.com and contact us. I am very excited. We have a fellow doctor in the house. We have today, we have Dr. Steve Sudell, creator of the Neck Hammock. And I've tried to find a solution for this for many years. There's not been a good solution. So thank God, Dr. Steve, you actually created this. And the Neck Hammock is a simple, portable, FDA-approved medical device that attaches to any door, rail, or pole and helps with neck pain relief in 10 minutes or less. So many people have neck pain relief. You have text neck, you're texting and on the computer. People, if you're watching this right now, you're probably, you know, probably leaning over and you shouldn't be. So they've achieved significant success on both Kickstarter and Indiegogo, raising over $1.6 million and selling over 30,000 units in a very short period of time. Uh, in fact, the neck hammock was ranked in the top 1% of all crowdfunding campaigns. Why? Because it's a solution people are looking for. So Dr. Steve, thanks for joining me. What's some feedback you got that helped you shape the product? You know, I'm sure you had a lot of iterations, a lot of versions. Something people said that, oh, I, I would tweak this or tweak that. I mean, obviously you use your own personal experience. I'm curious, are there any turning points in, in customer feedback? I didn't. The um, we haven't changed the actual shape of the product at all since uh, we really launched the product because that was an area that I spent a lot of time on, and I tested it on a lot of different head shapes and sizes and those things. So we felt pretty good about that. It is something that I think I will address here, you know, in like some of the the later versions. But the main concern or the main issues that I really had to tweak was the actual band. Um, the the tensile strength of the band, how we connected it to the neck hammock, like the new version is sewn directly into the neck hammock uh, to decrease overall assembly time. We also had to play with the different plastic clips. Um, we had just like a handful of cases of where they would break. Um, when you're talking thousands of units, if something is naturally going to happen like that, right. so we really had to increase the durability of the clips to withstand forces far beyond what you'd ever need to use it. Uh, the adjustability of the of the neck hammock, it, it used to be far less adjustable. Um, and I realized through people's feedback that a lot of people are not very intuitive when it comes to assembling things, even when you give them directions. Myself so I just, included, I, yes. Yeah, I just I had to make it as simple as possible to assemble and to put together. And you know, people are still naturally going to mess it up, but those are some of the, the biggest changes right. that we made to it. Doctor Steve, do you have any laying around close to you right now, by chance, or no? Uh, I can get one in about thirty feet away from me. Yes, get one, please. Okay. Yes. Right back. So as you're doing that, um, I just want to see it, and I want you all of them demonstrate exactly how you use it. Um, they do have a cool video on uh, neckhammock.com uh, that you could check out, but I figured while we have him here, he'll actually uh, show it to us and, and demonstrate it a little bit. So um, I was just saying that they can go on the website and check it out, but you know, you're here with us, just show it to us, show a little bit of how it works for people. 
for sure. Yeah. Um, so this is if you were to buy uh, the actual like retail box, like in stores, this is what it would look like. It has a little bit of um, directions on the back, but when you open the box, for most people, if you buy it online, you're going to get it in this. Yeah. Okay. It comes in this nice plastic bag and travel bag. And then as we open it up, as you can see, it comes fully assembled already. Nice. So you don't need to put anything together. Okay. This side attaches to a door knob or door jam. We then have the adjustable strap. So if your door is too high or too low, you can easily adjust it here. As I said before, the bungee is sewn directly into the neck hammock itself. And on the inside of the neck hammock, there's three pads. Nice. Okay. Yeah, you can't see that pad. from the video. You can yep. only, yeah, so that's nice. So the base pad kind of goes right underneath the base of the skull. And you basically would line your back nice and flat, close your eyes, and relax. Um, just some other things that comes with an eye mask that I strongly recommend that you use because that's just going to put you in a deeper state hmm. of relaxation. I'm going to buy it just for the eye mask. Yeah, it's <laughs> it, people. It's funny. Like I, I put that in there as like a nice little like gift and like add on. People love it. Like they use it outside of the, totally. the neck like, all the time. It also comes with an instruction manual of exactly how to use, how it works, and also, you know, who should not be using it. Um, and who should not be using it? Comes with contraindications. So, you know, we recommend kids under the age of sixteen probably not use it, even though it is very passive traction. We just, you know, want to mitigate you our be risk. Safe. Yeah. Anyone who has, you know, uh, hypermobilities of the spine, any any sort of contraindication with uh, cervical traction, we put in there for them to avoid. It also, based on feedback of people who like watch their videos and they're like, oh, what if someone opens the door and bangs in the head? We have this nice little door hanger <laughs> that we made that goes in the I other watched, side. There was, it was actually on Dr. Oz, right? You guys were on Dr. Oz and someone's demonstrating it. And he jokingly says... Now I'm going to open the door, but I didn't think of, oh, yeah, someone opens it from the other side. and Yeah, so, uh, you know, knock on wood, we haven't had any complaints of someone having a door open up on them. Uh, you know, we've had our other issues, but that's that's not been yeah. one of the things. They're far enough away probably that n may not hit them if it opens up also, but you don't want to risk it. Um, so how long should someone be tractioning for? We tell them to start with about 10 minutes, but work your way up to about 15, um, usually 20 at the, at the most. You, We've had people who have fallen asleep in it for hours and woken up feeling amazing, but I don't want to encourage that because right. we don't want to really overstretch those those totally. structures of the neck, you know? Uh, but, but set a timer for 15 to 20 minutes. We actually, on our website, have some meditation videos already made that have cool. the built-in 15-minute timer that goes really nicely with this while you're using it. Because so much of neck pain, too, is just from people being stressed and keeping everything in their shoulders totally. that we can just get them to relax and let go. Yeah. I mean, that, helps. that alone helps, yeah, but obviously the extra traction. I mean, I believe, I mean, this is going to be an epidemic. We're going to see this. Um, this isn't fully going to manifest for years to come because as you know people are like five six seven ten texting now and on their phone for hours and that's going to manifest in even worse things in my opinion than what we're experiencing with adults now so this is going to be huge for people i just yeah i don't it's a problem that's only getting worse i mean i the latest statistic that i saw was somewhere around the the ballpark of 21 point like three percent of americans suffer from some sort of neck pain at this time either two out of ten people are suffering from neck pain and like you said with i would have guessed like eight out media, of ten i mean i yeah, would have guessed way higher it's got to be it, it's got to be higher than that but but either way though it, it's a massive problem yeah. and you know how do we solve neck pain most people just take drugs you know and, and that's really what i'm trying to get away from yeah. with a product like this totally um 
Dr. Steve, first of all, thank you. I'm going to, I have two last questions, but I want to just tell people you should go to neckhammock.com um, or Amazon to get it. Um, I'm going to get one for sure, 100%. Um, I'm going to recommend patients get one. Um, so I think it's important, even if you don't have neck pain, to prevent neck pain, in my opinion. But it's not as motivating to get it unless you're having excruciating pain. But in my opinion, why wait, right? So go there. Um, Dr. Steve, two last questions. Um, since it's Inspired Insider, I always ask, one, what's been a low moment and how you push through? And two, what's been just a really proud moment uh, that you've experienced in the journey? You know, I would say that the lowest moment came when all of the knockoffs and counterfeits started popping up. I mean, they were popping up at, at a rate that it just, the best way to describe it is it just kills your mojo. It's, it makes you question why you're even doing this, like why you've invested so much time and money and effort into something that someone can just steal your idea and just, you know, reap all the rewards. Uh, that was a really low moment that, you know, was tough to get through that just took day at a time just understanding that there's going to be that market, you know, that piece of the pie out there for those types of people. And, you know, I'm going to try to, to minimize that as much as possible, but it's just going to be there, you know. And so understanding that and then moving past that, um, you know, yeah. it took a while for me. Um, but then, you know, fast forward, I mean, there's been for, – for me, the, the biggest highs that I get is still the daily testimonials that, like, get, you know, texted to me, you know, via Instagram or via email and saying, like, you know, the people that were just suffering from such bad chronic pain and who've tried all the things and this has given them so much relief. Like that, in my opinion, you know, supersedes being featured on Dr. Oz. Like I, I was featured in a, a Forbes article a few weeks ago. And like those, those things are all like really cool. But when people still reach out and just tell me like how much they appreciate the product and are thankful for it, like that, that to me is, is exactly like why I did this in the first place. Yeah, totally. Everyone check out neckhammock.com. If you don't know how to spell it, I'll spell it for you. It's neck and then H-A-M-M-O-C-K.com. Dr. Steve, I want to be the first one to thank you. This is an awesome product and uh, I'm looking forward to getting it. I, I really appreciate the podcast. I really enjoyed myself and can't wait to hear what you think. Thank you. What I got you can't buy It resides between my eyes Walk through the fire Came out better on the other side See life's like a beach if you find the sand And right now I'm feeling like a hundred grand